Tomorrows are built out of today's. Internal poise and harmony are necessary to receive the ideas within. Transmissions come from the realm of infinite ideas. Learning to hear them is the key. Coming into a harmonious relationship means embodying its attributes and making them a part of you. The universal mind is unlimited in the possibilities and the effects it can produce. You have the mechanism that transforms universal potential power into things. Your purpose must be creative and constructive. Your faith must be strong. Faith is the engine that brings manifestation. It energizes your desire. Thinking is the action you take on the universal. Effects are the reactions from the universal on your thoughts. Your mind has the ability to express every attribute of virtue or principle that exists. It is a vast world with seeds that can grow into whatever you are forming in your thoughts. At first, things may not respond immediately, but the more you concentrate, the sooner they will. You can turn this mind influence on any part of your body and eliminate undesirable conditions. In business, you'll have discernment and a higher level of understanding. Looking within makes you a match for all your good desire. Great people have learned how to withdraw from the multitudes and seek solitude in order to plan, think, and generate the right mental mood. You see, ideas come to those who are receptive, prepared, and in a successful frame of mind. You are learning to be one of those people, to place yourself in unity with universal intelligence. You are learning that all things are connected. You are learning the basic principles of thinking. This is why you're changing your conditions and multiplying your results. You are learning that your circumstance and environment always follow the trend of your mental and spiritual progress. You can't run away from it. Inspiration leads to action. Perception leads to opportunity. And in all things, the spiritual must come before the physical. Mental and physical anxiety are the main causes of human suffering. We suffered because we'd only been given partial information. Imperfect information leads to misery. Cultivating your powers of attention and concentration is key. When your focus is properly directed, the results can be astounding. You only dissipate your power by scattering it from one object to another. No results are gotten this way. Every time you lose focus, you lose the effects your thoughts were having. These concepts are simple, but no one ever said they were easy. But proficiency always comes with practice. Till you reach the day when you overcome obstacles as they appear.